What plans do you have and how are you going to go about it? Against my better judgment, I just listened to or watched a live stream of Donald Trump speaking in Ocala, Florida. And I don't know why I did. I guess, you know, it's, it's less than 30 days out from the election and I've seen the debates and I'm wondering if he's starting to hone his platform, if, if he's getting some ideas and, and on, on the table. But I don't know what I was thinking. All I heard basically was him ripping apart Hillary Clinton and making these hyperbolic claims. Oh, I'm going to do this and it's going to be the best you've ever seen. It's going to be the biggest and the greatest and I can do everything. And, and I'm like, but how are you going to do it? Have you even set aside anything to say, okay, I'm going to build this wall. I'm going to make them pay for it. I'm going to do it like this, 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 and this. Oh, I'm going to put out all of these immigrants, but I'm going to do it like this, 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 and this. He has not given in debate or in his speeches that I have seen any that he has any idea of how politics works. He seems to have no idea of how laws are made in this country. And he seems to come off as someone that he thinks he's going to be a dictator. He's just going to say, you do it and it's going to happen. I'm going to say, do it and it's going to happen. I'm going to make Mexico pay and they don't know that they're going to do it, but they're going to do it and they're going to like us better. He actually said that. They're going to like us better. And he was said that I said, I tweeted, I said, well, did the people who he didn't pay as much as he told them he was going to pay when they did work for him, did they like him better after they didn't, after he didn't pay them? I kind of doubt it. I just don't understand the people following him. And please tell me down in the comments. See, my thing is this. I, when I listen to a debate or when I see someone speak, I don't want to hear all this stuff that the networks and the news are talking about. I don't want to hear all of these sound bites. I don't want to hear that. I want to hear what are your policy positions? How do you plan to get things done? Who can you work with across the aisle that is going to get the things that we need done in this country? Get more jobs, better infrastructure, better schools, more education. How are you going to do that? Not that I'm going to do it and it's going to be the greatest ever, but that I'm going to do this, this, and this. I have tried this, this, and this. I can work with these people in order to come up with a plan. I don't want to hear sound bites. The reason I would watch, I can hear sound bites from CNN. I can hear sound bites from Fox. I can hear sound bites from Democracy Now! even. But I want to hear what the candidate is planning on doing while they are in office. I just get frustrated. I just get so frustrated. And then, of course, I am on Twitter. And let me tell you, I am almost less, I'm, I'm less enamored of Donald Trump than I am of Hillary Clinton. But I'm not head over heels for Hillary Clinton either. And I am looking at third party candidates myself. But the point is, get your point across. Tell us what's going on. And for people who are debating with others about what's going to happen or, or why they believe in their candidate, don't tell me, oh, Obama did this and Hillary said that and, and, and Nixon did this and Bush did that. I want to hear what your candidate plans to do. I want to hear about policies. I want to hear about what is going to happen if this doesn't work out, and if that doesn't work out, well, maybe we can try this. I don't want to hear, once again, repeal and replace, because we have been working towards some kind of healthcare system that works since way before even Ronald Reagan. We've been trying to get universal health care in this country. And if the Republicans wanted universal health care, it would have been done already. But it's not been done. What are they going to replace it with? Tell me what you're going to replace it with. What plans do you have and how are you going to go about it? Then I will actually start to listen to what you have to say.